The other big race of the night in the Commonwealth, U.S. Senate. Incumbent Democratic Senator Tim Kaine will serve another term. He defeated Republican challenger Corey Stewart with 57% of the vote. 10 on your side's Maria Elena Beloris has reaction to his win. A Virginia that works for all is the message that Senator Tim Kaine campaigned on, and it's the one that he shared tonight here in Falls Church after claiming victory in his reelection campaign. The race was called right around 7 o'clock tonight, just after the polls closed here in Virginia. In that time, we heard from multiple Democratic leaders last night, including Senator Mark Warner and Governor Ralph Northam. When Senator Kane finally took the stage around 930, he said the results of tonight's election show who the people of Virginia are and what the state is all about. You rejected in a very clear way. You rejected in a very clear way in Virginia the politics of division and hatred. And you rejected it because we've been there, we've done that, we got the scar tissue, we're not going back. Nobody will send us backwards, we're not going to do it. He also mentioned that the voters show that they want an economy for all, jobs for all, equality for all. And he also talked about that blue wave that we have heard a lot about this midterm season. He says what's more important, though, is the wave of compassion, caring, love and justice that he also feels the voting showed in this election. So. He says they obviously were happy to win, but now it's time to get to work. In Falls Church, I'm Maria Elena Baloris, 10 on your side.